I, I was in this uh, Situ detention camp. Mm, it is in the way back in the backyards of uh, Lhasa, behind Kotal. Mm -hmm. And uh, near to our uh, detention camp is uh, Sangip uh, uh, Army Cantonment. Sangip Army Cantonment. Sangip would be S A N G Y I P. Sangip uh, Cantonment. And every morning we could hear um, there is uh, some kind of Chinese music blaring from the uh, uh, you know from the loudspeaker. We could hear, and then uh, army practicing their kung fu. Ah, oh, like that. You know, we could hear. Um, and then there is some blast also happening uh, quite nearby our place, and they, we heard that they were building a road uh, near the uh, near the uh, hillock. Our detention camp is um, is um, uh, a detention camp for political prisoners. We were, I think, about uh, sixty something prisoners at the time. Um, I was in uh, barrack one, cell number three. Cell number one was a toilet. Cell number two is a political prisoner called Tawagenzi. Cell number three was uh, a Chinese. Uh, arrested from Shenzhen and I was the new cellmate for him so we were together for almost about a month until we fought and he was sent out <laughs> um, so I, I was in that prison for uh, in that prison for three months every morning I used to wait for food uh, I used to get um, a, a small bowl of uh, hot water and Timo. Uh, Timo is a steamed bun. Very small. You know, I used to uh, fear squeezing them because it, then it becomes very small. <laughs> I used to love it as, as puffed as it, as it looked. <clears throat> and um, that was for breakfast. And, um, mo uh, and most of the time I spent my time looking out of the window, <clears throat> resting my face on the window grill. Um, there used to be this shadow of the uh, kitchen that was in front of us, shadow falling on the ground in front of us, and I used to wait the shadow moving slightly like this all the time towards some. There was a point, as a small stone, and it reached there. That's lunchtime. <laughs> so I used to wait, and sometimes instead of the shadow moving towards it. It started. It seemed as if it was not moving, <laughs> or it was moving backwards. <laughs> I was very disappointed. <laughs> so I used to take rounds in the in the jail mm -hmm. and in my cell. Uh, I think that's when I uh, learned one thing. I learned how to keep my hands in my back pocket and walk round and round and round in deep thoughts. Mm -hmm. It was a very good uh, practice of meditation, kind of. Uh, because we are all, all the time in the outside and I, I lived in India, I lived in, you know, I, by then I had finished my graduation. I lived in the most possibly free country and free atmosphere as a student, and a college student. And here I was for the first time in my life in prison, that too in the most dreaded prison in Lhasa. Mm -hmm.